package yourself up two or three pounds of the shit and then <sighs> mail it back to your last days more, in prison. This is way more illegal than buying yeah. a Who's dime checking bag off the of mail? Fucking- yeah, but back on the pot thing, like it seems like, dude, if that brings some sort of mental stress and uh, and and like I said, nausea and um, appetite, then wow, doesn't that seem perfect? I think it's the first thing that I, I, you know, go to college campus. Like, hello, fellow children. Yeah, yeah. Where can I get a hookup? <laughs> hello, fellow sunglasses kids. and a ball cap. I swear to God, I I don't know what I do. Like, would I tweet? Because I, I feel like a fan. Would I tweet? Right? Oh my God. <laughs> How do I score pot? I have no idea. You have you a teenage daughter. Google things. I don't think she knows either. Well, she uh, can no, find you out. You know what? Yeah, but she would know someone who knows. Here, I'll give you a quick yeah. answer. Craigslist. There you go. I wasn't. I didn't think that would be a thing. I didn't know that it was. Is. Um, but yeah, I'm sure she knows someone that smokes pot and and. and uh, I could surprised. find a connection. She She's 16. Ask her. I She's 16. Right no. she, she knows a lot of people who smoke pot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I think that not in her. In her but, I would take that bet. I don't think she has anyone in her network reach that smokes pot. Yeah. I think she does. I mean, just 16. Of course you do. It's a small school. Like, you, you can't even be in such a small well, group. Is, I don't know. Yeah, I bet she does. Uh, I'm. Yeah, we knew the kid it, it, when I was fifteen or sixteen. Like we knew who who smoked pot. Like yeah. it was there was a few guys who did, and it was like really their older brothers or something who were the real uh, source of the whole thing or whatever. But like there were people, and we we knew. And, and like, yeah, this junior in high school, right? There's someone out there whose identity involves smoking pot, who she could just talk to or something. Like, have you seen like, any of those kids when you've gone to drop her off and pick her up anywhere, done any school related things? You, yeah, I'm sure you know who to look for. I, yeah, I mean, at that age, you can tell pretty easy because they make it like an integral part of their identity. <laughs> like that, they it's like you know you can spot Petey Pothead from a hundred yeah, yards right? away because he's got his you know marijuana shirt on and yeah. you know his just backpack has the, whole has the leaf embroidered yeah. into it or something. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing even wrong with it, man. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, or, or you know, like have I seen the kid? You say I don't. know. I've seen kids with long hair. <gasps> wow. Nixon I think would you would just get, like, like <laughs> I think if you wanted so much that you were going to deal with cancer, like why wouldn't you just go to Colorado and then and then package it well and mail it back to your PO box? Cuz that's very illegal. That's trafficking drugs well, over state lines. Well, you're already like saying like I care more about, you know, not suffering for the next however many months chemo is than than like the law. Like you're already taking the law in your own hands. So so like I feel like that'd be the way to go. Yeah. How are you already taking? You're taking the law into your hands when you do that illegal activity. You're talking about. You're already planning an illegal activity. Like, like that's the whole point of what we're doing here. Is that he, he's saying that he would get like if he got cancer, he he wouldn't care about the law. He'd get himself some weed. And I'm saying like, why would you want to deal with some shady 17 year old that 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 might narc your 40 year old ass out and mess your life up? Why wouldn't you just fly to Colorado, make a make a trip out of it, package yourself up two or three pounds of the shit? And then <laughs> mail it back to your last days in more, prison. This is way more illegal than buying yeah. a dime Who's bag checking off the of mail? You really think the the the, the mail? Well, Nobody now they're checking the, the mail. Well, they're, I feel like the, the <laughs> Kyle, <laughs> you're pounds? risking twenty five years in jail. Yeah, you'd be like fine. That. They would get Two, you for pounds? trafficking. If I, they would think I was dealing if I shipped myself three pounds. Yeah, I'm, but well, on, okay, on the other hand, ounces, whatever if you buy less than an ounce locally then it seems like there's a slap on the wrist. Sometimes it's just a fine, and it's not even like a criminal thing. I don't know what North Carolina does. You'd probably yeah. get shot during the arrest.